So this is just a quick video to show how to do the finding isoelectric point question. Um, it's pretty straightforward. So it's, it's just an example with uh, alanine, lysine, aspartic acid, arginine, valine, isoleucine, and glutamine. And what I like to do is first write out all the values that you need that are relevant to the question from the chart provided for us. So in the case of alanine, <coughs> it doesn't have a side group. So all you need is the terminal um, pKa. And traditionally, it's written from N terminus to C terminus. So you pick the N terminus of the album, which would be 9.87. So 9.87. Then you have your next one, which is your lysine. So you don't need to look at your uh, terminuses here because it's in the middle of the chain. And you look at your side chain, and in this case, it'd be 10.54. Then you have your aspartate, um, and again, it's in the middle, so you look at your side chain, which is 3.9. Uh, same goes for arginine, which is 12.48. And then valine has no side chain, and same for isoleucine, so you don't have to consider them. That's the great thing about when you have um, groups in the, in the uh, sequence without any side chains, you can kind of just uh, forget about them they're not really relevant. So you can cross those out because they're not going to contribute to the pKa or the isoelectric point. And lastly, glutamine. This is the tricky part um, because glutamine, you have to consider that it has a, it has a side chain, which is 4.07, but it's also the terminus, the C terminus, so it'd be the acidic one, and you'd pick 2.1. Then the part is you pretty much find the media, um, the, the media. So I just like to cut from bottom up, bottom up, but you see what I mean. So the lowest one, cut, highest one, cut, then find the next lowest one, 3.9, cut, and then the next highest one, cut, and then you'd be left with two. You should usually be left with two, otherwise you probably did something wrong, but those would be your two. Find the average of those two, and that should give you the answer of 6.97, which is your isoelectric point. Um, hope that helped. That's pretty much it. Thanks.